Hello YouTube and welcome to my video. This is being filmed after the rest of the video. So I'm just here to introduce the video. I was planning on looking a bit more presentable. I mean, I've got clean hair, that's something. Um, but this video is to introduce you to Dexter, the newest member of our family. Dexter is 11 weeks old and he is a little rascal, as you will see throughout this video. <laughs> so I'm just going to add the rest of the clips from what I've already pre-filmed after this one, just so you can get kind of an introduction of how our first week of having a puppy has been, because it has tested us. And I honestly felt like... I was so drained. Um, it's Saturday today and I filmed up to today and honestly yesterday I thought like there was just nothing of me left. <laughs> this is how you look after, well this is, I think this is kind of day two of having Puppo. I feel like I cannot get dressed, I cannot get ready, I cannot do anything. Um because he demands so much attention. So like, I washed my hair last night and I literally went to bed with it wet, where it was slightly damp, but I've done nothing to it. I've not looked after myself at all since having the puppo. Josh and I adopted a dog. Um, <laughs> got ourselves a puppy. So that was, so today is Tuesday. We picked up the puppy on Sunday and i feel like i cannot function right now i feel like i am a new mother that is struggling with life <laughs> i haven't been able to read i like i can't even get dressed at the moment i am gonna sort myself out i mean it's taken some adjusting i don't know if you can see the eye bags <laughs> he howls like mad like before he sleeps and then First night he got up at like four, between four and five. And then this morning it was like closer, like it was two something, but closer to three, I think. And it, it's just been chaos. I say that, but we love him. His name is Dexter. He is currently next to me, but he's having a nibble. What are you nibbling yourself for? You got something on you? I think he's got some sort of dry skin on his leg, like on his back. So he's going to the vets tomorrow um, to have some vaccinations. So we're going to get them to have a look as well, because he's really like scratching himself. And uh, it's making his fur quite thin at the back where he's just constantly scratching. And I can't see anything apart from like quite a bit of dry skin, bless him. So he's... 11 weeks old he is a springer spaniel i will obviously put some pictures up and some videos of him as well uh but this is mainly going to be a vlog of me documenting the start of our lives with dexter <laughs> we we've had to do so much to adjust our lives like at the moment i'm working fully full-time from home for the next two weeks I have to make sure I keep taking him outside to teach him that's where he goes to the toilet. Um, we have to make sure there are puppy pads down, that there's nothing for him to bite or chew. Um, I've registered him at a vet, which I'm taking him to tomorrow. We have got a puppy trainer and carer for when I go back to work one day a week. And it's just a big life adjustment and I know it's going to be worth it and I love him to bits but I'm so exhausted um I just feel like he needs all my attention all of the time um what else have we had to do oh we've contacted someone to sort our garden out because he thinks putting brambles in his mouth is a good idea so that's lots of fun Dexter stop it now come on I know. We're going to get it looked at tomorrow. Hopefully get you something for the itching. It upsets you as well, doesn't it, my boy? Doesn't it? 
Doesn't it, my boy? Yeah. Look, it's you. Can you see? <laughs> Stop looking at me. Look, can you see you? Baby boy? Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> he likes the face, don't you? You do. You like the face. Yes, you do. Can you see you? Look. Look at you. No. <laughs> That's you. So he's currently watching the dog run around outside from the sofa. Was you watching the doggos? Oh my boy! <laughs> yeah! Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much. Do you know that I had a piece to bury it? Bury it? Actually, I tried to I'm not allowed to even touch the smoke. <laughs> Why have you put your hood up? Oh, fuck. Oh, my. Oh, my. We can cleanse the jewelry. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my I don't know if I look as tired as I have been. It is day three, I suppose, of having a pup. <laughs> and as you can see, he's ex as excitable as ever. Today's the first day that I actually feel like I managed to do something, like get ready. I've done, like, I say I've done my hair. I've used the straighteners on it. I have got dressed. And these are things I felt like I couldn't do the last few days. So, uh He's settling in okay. He's a bit bitey. He's got his jab today. So uh, we found out that he missed his booster jab. And i um, just going to do my eye cream while I'm attacked and I talk to you. Uh, he, Let me just turn a light on as well. That might help. There we go. So he missed a booster jab, which means that he's got to start it again. He's got to start the whole session again, doesn't it, baby boy? And so me and Josh are taking him this afternoon. So if I remember, I'll try and film some of it or take you along. Not him actually having the jab, but us going, that type of thing. And then tomorrow we've got somebody coming to sort the garden out for him. So I'll try and film a before and after. Once it's a bit lighter outside, I'll get a before shot. I have got pictures, which I can put up, but I'll do a shot of how awful it is before and then the after once it's completed tomorrow. Um, and then on Friday, we've got the dog care sitter, doggy daycare person come in to meet him and also discuss a training plan. Um, and we're going to book in when she can have him when I go back to the office and I start doing office days again. It'll only be one day a week, but I'm not going to leave him by himself. So I'm glad I've got someone come in that we can meet her. So that's Friday evening. Um, she's due here the same time Josh usually gets home. So it's good that we'll both meet her and obviously Dex will meet her as well. So... I feel like my week is mental, yet the weekend I pretty much have no plans at all. Um, and that's probably a good thing because uh, he's not sleeping through the night very well at the moment. He's uh, wanting to get up at stupid times, aren't you? Yeah. So I've just put some lip stuff on so he can smell that. <laughs> Don't stop cleaning my face. Oh. So, uh... Look, it's you. No? Okay. Um, yeah, so the nights have been getting worse instead of better. So potty training's going quite well at the moment. He's being very good. Um, however, sleeping is not great. <laughs> I do end up on the sofa with him uh, between like three and four kind of every morning. And that does need to stop eventually. So... We will be talking to the puppy trainer about that 
um, on Friday. Uh, today, when we take him to the vets, we need to talk about his scratchings. We think he's got some sort of dry skin because he gets a bit flaky and he doesn't stop biting himself. Um, so we need to talk to the vet about that and his claws are so sharp. Ow, don't do that. Um, his claws, claws are so sharp that he doesn't mean to and he'll end up scratching us. So that's another thing to talk to the vet about. So he's going through the motions. <laughs> this is uh, my life at the moment. I've done no reading and I miss reading so much. So I might say to Josh one evening, you're on... Uh, baby boy duty and uh i'm gonna read my book but uh, uh your claws are too sharp for jumping at my skin yes they are oh he loves jumping at the face as well he just thinks it's so fun to jump at the face sometimes i'll be working and he just looks at me and i know it's coming and he just like headbutts my nose <laughs> but uh yeah all the joys of uh, having a pup. I will look back at this and be like, oh, what he put us through. <laughs> Stop biting. It's naughty. Stop it. No, no, no. This is the disaster that is our garden. It's a puppo. Um, so, yeah, this is just not ideal for a small boy so um he also seems to think biting brambles is a good idea so um we're very grateful or thankful we've managed to find someone that's going to come and help or come and sort it for us aren't we sort it for us tomorrow yeah these are my dad's shoes and me and Josh just used them as going in the garden shoes. I really feel like this camera, this camera, this video is like captain's log day one. <laughs> it's like what astronauts do to keep track of their time. Did you know that? He likes to explore and run around in the garden a lot so once it's all clear we'll feel a lot better about him doing that Dexter what are you doing what are you doing gorgeous boy are you playing yeah. get your toy get your toy go get your toy no you want to jump on me now don't you yeah look at you Look at you. Should I get you up? Okay. You're going to do it? Oh, my baby. Almost. Thanks. Mommy, help. Dexter. Come here, my baby. Doug. What, what is happening? You're on my face. Ah. No, no, good. Oh, I love you too. That's a lot of kisses. Dex. Oh, you bumped my nose. He likes to sit as high up as possible on me. Don't you? Can you see us? Can you see us? Yeah. Hello. Been telling everyone that I was one of the girls sleeping over at my angel, aren't you? He's only kind of just learned licking. <laughs> Before he was just kind of pressing his mouth like his face to ours. It was kind of adorable, actually, wasn't it, baby boy? She was adorable. I love, like, him as a puppy. But, like, it's going to be so different when he's, like, a super big boy. <laughs> No, but here's what's different. I'm not putting up with your BS anymore. Baby just... boy. I was going to film because she was watching the TV. Wouldn't you? Who was watching telly? Yeah, she was. Yeah. Apparently, this was an invitation for him to, to jump on me again. <laughs> Isn't it? Is that what it is? Yeah. Is that what it is? The baby. The baby. You sliding. 
Oh, here we go. Yeah, you jump back up. There he goes. There he goes. Yeah. <laughs> He's just resting his face on mine. Oh. He's a cutie. And you. Yeah. So there's been a slight change of change of plans and everything seems to be happening today. So it's quarter past 10 and the person to do the garden is actually now coming today. So garden and vets are being done, both for me and Josh are working. So we've got a hectic day ahead of us. I'm glad I managed to film that clip now of what the garden looks like at the moment because uh, it's about to change. <laughs> Hello, ignore this. Um, that big box behind me is actually a blind to go up. Um, but since having a puppy, things have been manic. Um, so my second diary came. I ordered a second diary to start planning more for YouTube. Um, I love a moleskin notebook. So this is my second diary. I haven't opened it yet. But I'm going to start planning more. Hang on, let me mute the TV. Okay, so I'm going to start planning more for my YouTube videos. I was trying to do it in my day-to-day -day diary and planner. However, it was proving to be really difficult because I was getting a bit lost as to what needed doing when. Um, so I'm going to start planning all of my YouTube stuff in this one. So for this video is going to be a full introduction to Doggo. I'm also going to be filming a different video this weekend. And I also have a box here. So this came in the post today. And inside is obviously going to be books. If you know me, you'll know as books. Somebody's trying to open it for me. And um, this is going to be another video idea. So I have a few video hiccup a few video ideas on the go at the moment and to start with i was starting the year with a few ideas but nothing really that i was looking at filming straight away oh fun so there are a fair few books here So there was, they have this offer on all the time, which is three books for, I think it's six pounds. They're like two pound each. So I got these three. This has nothing to do with the video I was about to talk about. I wanted Never Lie because I have a copy of this, but it's like the indie version and I don't really like those copies. So I ordered the proper published copy and I prefer this so much more. Like, I'm very happy I've got, so I'll have two copies, but I much prefer this one. Just trying to see on my bookshelf where it is. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, so very happy I got that because I love that book. Then in the same offer, there was The Locked Door, also by Frieda McFadden. Haven't read this one, which is, um, whereas Never Lie is one of my favourites. I say one of my. I've read two books by her. And then I also got The Nanny, which apparently is quite raunchy. So they were £2 each. Like, if you can believe that for books. Like, to me, that's insane. And then we also have the Never After series. So this is what I'm thinking of filming, is me doing a reading vlog of these books. So this is where it's dark romance. I don't... I don't even know if I've ever read Dark Romance. Stop it. Naughty boy. Um, yeah, I don't know if I've ever read any Dark Romance. So this is going to be me trying some Dark Romance. It is also a series where it's the, it's like fairy tale retellings. The villain's the one with the happy ending. So I believe the first one is Hooked, which is... Captain Hook and Wendy and then we've got Scarred which is like Lion King type of retelling I'm not actually sure however these are the villains getting 
um kind of like their love story but it is dark romance um so what does it say for hooked james has always had one agenda destroy his enemy peter michaels when peter's 20 year old daughter wendy shows up in james's bar he sees a way in seduce the girl and use her for his revenge it's the perfect plan until the beat between them turns into real desire so video for these and i'm really looking forward to it i don't know if i'll get to all of the books in the one video maybe i'll do a series for them but I'm very much looking forward to it. Like, I almost want to start filming it straight away. And yeah, I'm in the middle of like, I think it's like three other books. Okay, so I need to go and turn up the pasta um, as Josh is on his way back. And we're going to have something to eat quickly um, before we have to take puppy to his appointment. gonna be a bit dirty gonna put these big shoes on aren't we pup well just me puppy i should be calling you your name dexter come on you out good boy come on then oh crumbs just run at me why don't you this is the garden now so that needs to be collected and moved and then all of this rubbish but he's done a great job um his kind of mower type thing did kind of die on him so he's gonna strim the um grass again one more time go over it on friday and bring some weed killer as well because there's some some brambles and things still but we've got a nice empty garden for a little boy to roam around on and he's going for a wee like a good boy yes he is oh he's a good boy you can have a treat yeah good boy oh he's a good boy oh but that is great that is great look how much room you've got to run around yeah what are you doing, baby boy? You gonna run around? You got a leaf? <laughs> Where are you, Angel? There he is! There he is! He still wants to find something to bite or steal or chew and play with. <laughs> He's going inside now. Dexter! He doesn't like that step there, bless him. Oh, you did it! Oh, you good boy. Come on then. Come on then. Come on then. Should we go inside? No, oh, gosh. <laughs> what have you got? What did you just have? Why is there a crock? Why is there a crock under the table, mister? What did you do? <laughs> what did you do? Dexter? Dexter? What did you do? Dexter? Dexter? You're going after the second one, are you? Dexter? What are you doing? What have you got? Oh my god, she was in the right at the beginning of this episode. <laughs> Dear lord. It's day four. Oh, he's actually having a wee. Filming you in again. Here you go, good boy. Good boy. So it's day four. And uh, 
he decided he didn't want to sleep last night. There was no sleep involved at all. And he's got all the energy in the world. He is not bothered by the fact that he kept me and Josh awake. He is absolutely fine running around mental. Hasn't even rested this morning and he's just, he's a crazy boy. Are we going inside then, are we? Come on then. You don't need any more food, mister. You've had breakfast, haven't you? Oh, actually, we'll give you your dental stick because you take that and it takes you a minute to eat it, doesn't it? It takes you a minute. Yeah, here you go. Dexter. Oh. Come on, this way. Good boy. Yeah, usually you'll take his dental stick under the uh, the table or like we can see here, eat it on the backpack. He likes sitting on this backpack, so I've just kind of left it on the floor for him. But hopefully uh, this will keep him occupied for five. So today Dexter has killed the Care Bear's nose and is pulling stuff out of his nose. So, uh, don't know if Care Bear is going to be friends with Dexter anymore. As you can see, I've also confiscated Josh's slippers because Dexter seems to think he can chew them. And so that is <laughs> the update for the day. There's a waggy tail because there's a little boy having his dinner. Is that nice, baby boy? <laughs> Look how wild and crazy. <laughs> I just like, oh, I don't know what's going on. Um, <laughs> me and Josh got absolutely no sleep last night. He was howling and barking and whining all night. I have just felt not with it at all today. And I had a support meeting in work about possible ADHD stuff. And it was just, it was a lot. As well as feeling tired, I've not got long left of work today. And I'm exhausted. Me and Josh are going to have toasties and try and sleep all evening. We are just so drained. Like, we love this pup. But we're counting down the minutes to the weekend because... He's killing us off. <laughs> he is a bundle of joy. And you? No. no. Just Dexter. He looks so snug. Our precious baby. Why did you roll your eyes? I didn't know. It was just in the Oh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Does he care? Oh no, he's, he's already got one. Uh, we're like how he's just in a pile. He's got one and that's it, he's done. It's scary. Buy it. Buy it. <laughs> he just bonked Dexter, him. Dexter, take it. Dexter. You get that one. I like how he's thinking he's pinching it. <laughs> this side, this one's mine. It's like they're all yours. This is from. That. Yeah, get the bones open. And this. Dexter, come here. Which one should we give him first? He likes biting these. Should keep him a bit busier. Yeah. Are you having a shrug? Oh, this bloody thing. What you got, Dexy? Off 
rim one. Next on this. Take it. Take it in. Take it. I should keep them occupied now. Oh, it's smelling it, right? They don't really smell? No. Maybe it's just the taste then. Yeah. And there's this thing. We need to put treats in this, don't we? Yeah. Do we have to put treats in there? Or well, no, we... we can just play with it, but obviously it'll be more occupied if there are treats in it. I think he's just got happy he's got things to bite right now. I think I'm going to end this video here. Um, I, I planned on filming so much more, trying to get more footage. I planned on today being a big filming day. There was so much I wanted to do, but I'm still recovering from the first week of having Papo. It has been such a tiring week. <laughs> We're exhausted. But he is getting there. I mean, today he has entertained himself a couple of times. And um, we've bought him a load of new toys, which you've just seen. And he has been chewing the bones as well. So, you know, it's, he's a work in progress. But he's lovely. We love him dearly. And uh, although things are hard, they will get easier, won't they, pup? Won't they? Um we had a meeting yesterday with a the dog carer or trainer who's going to look after him once a week when i'm back in the office did you like the lady and she's also going to be putting a training plan together for us which is super helpful so um yeah the duvet that's behind me has been there all week because some little boy likes to get up at like, like there's usually between four, could be four or five. It's just very early. So once he's been fed and he goes to the toilet, we lie on the sofa. So we've got the summer duvet out for downstairs and the winter duvet out for upstairs where it seems to be very cold. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, it was something a bit different. I hope to look a bit more put together in my future videos. I like I have wrote down in my new my my YouTube diary a list of videos I want to film and it's just finding the time, especially with Puppo now being in the mix as well. Like this isn't this isn't what we expected to be doing at the start of the year but it's just it is what it is we've got ourselves a little baby he's adorable we love him dearly and um i will be posting more frequently once i got a schedule once he's settled things like that I, do you know what? I was so YouTube focused, uh, like coming into the start of the year and that's just completely changed since having pop because I just, I'm so tired. I haven't had it in me to be filming and working and <sighs> this is real life. This is what it's like. I don't know what else to say. Have a super duper good one and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. You gonna say bye? You gonna say bye? Do you not know that one?